de María Jiménez, journalist. Hello, good afternoon to both authorities. I would like the question is the Larov. The Russian government has been a front defensor of the sovereignty of the countries of Latin America and has rejected the, uh, the foreign currency in Latin America. How do you how do you value this current situation in countries like Cuba, Nicaragua, Venezuela? And what play, what play does it role in the integration of the nations? What are their initiatives to threaten cooperation and the dialogue between Russia and Latin America? The countries that these countries are the countries that show their guide to on their own for the memory of the presidents and they also they also choose the movements of uh, independent movements. Tomorrow, there's going to be there's going to be the date of the the beginning of the fight for independence, and we are saying that uh, friends of Venezuelan and we say that the fight continues and there are many tries of there are many tries to to end the stance of the independence in the thoughts in another part of the world and we understand that very well so that is important to to have all that efforts officially in the framework of peace and in other formats to counter and to avoid blackmails and the threats with Venezuela, we have we have a very big agenda, and we have uh, big projects, and we also have the operations that in practice have threatened the treats and are the changes in our economies that do not do not depend on the on black males from our from the Western countries. We also also have these uh, relations with Nicaragua, with Cuba, and uh, we are going to continue. We are going to continue leading with the leaders of these countries, and in the economic aspect, it plays an important role because because these uh, years, these years are within the principle of colonization and uh, USA that in, they are in the international community, all these principles in the market, in the free market, uh, all these principles are in the free market and in the, and the resentment of innocence and also all the principles of property can punish those who are not uh, useful for them and disobey and those of, of those who disobey the rivals of Russia and those and uh, those who have a future as China and remember as the Latin American region was released of Dutron Morrow. But recently, we have recently heard of some announcements to return that Dutron and uh, Cuba and Nicaragua are not three, there are more that are protesting and uh, fighting for their rights and for their own um, and they are based on the principle uh, they are based on the principles and they are not going to exclude and they are going to defend their position their equitative position through through the world, through the world, through the order of the world, multipolar, democratic, we are going to 
We are going to develop a cooperation with all these countries and we are going to help them. We are going to help them achieve their objective that condemn them.